I'm curious about two things here. First of all, where the hell are all the Alex Belfield fanatics who usually come here to tell me off for making yet another Alex Belfield video when I've done exactly the same thing about King Charles? Now, this is the fifth video I've made about the coronation and King Charles in less than a week. And yet there are no Alex Belfield fans here complaining that I'm picking on him making too many videos on him and the usual oh here we go again yet another alex belfield video <laughs> where are you why aren't you moaning and whinging about this one it's the same principle you bunch of utter towering hypocrites you anyway the second thing i am curious about and yes this is another king charles coronation video and so you see before you the scottish first minister the unelected scottish first minister hamza Yusuf accompanied by what looks like the witch out of the Bugs Bunny cartoons. And they're both wearing tartan. And I'm confused. Well, because isn't this cultural appropriation? And what clan's tartan are they wearing? You see, in Scotland, tartan patterns represent different Scottish clans, like McDonald's, Stewart's, etc. But I've never heard of a clan Yusuf, have you? Now, if I, as a Caucasian European were to wear another culture's uh, dress, then I promise you, I would be hounded on social media for cultural appropriation. The woke lefties are always crying about it, for heaven's sake. Now, I had a video pulled from my previous channel. Now, it was one of the last ever videos I made for my old channel before I deleted said channel. And it was removed for cultural appropriation because in that video, I was wearing a Native American headdress. So to the end, why do people of other cultures wear clothing that is culturally and historically Caucasian European and nobody bats an eyelid? Now, I really wouldn't care about this if the other side didn't make such a fuss and torment and cancel people for doing exactly the same thing. I don't get it. So if somebody could kindly let me know in the comments if there is a clan Yusuf in Scotland and if it does indeed have its own tartan print, or is this guy culturally appropriating traditional Scottish clothing here? And there we go, that's my video. Let me know what you think in the comments. Until the next time, Roger Trout.